Good morning, what's up guys, so Raven here with another fantastic deck. Hopefully coffee is kicking in so we can talk about the Eternatus. And this deck has been sent to me by Josh, by uh, one of my friends uh, on the stream. And well, this is of course the Poison Eternatus. A really good deck that can take you really, really far. And this is one that I'm... I am kind of using right now in the Players Cup uh, this one and the other one that I've posted this week. So yeah, you have two different versions depending on what you enjoy and what you like. Um, there is one card that maybe you can change and I'll tell you exactly what it is. But for now, we all know Eternatus, I don't think we need any explanation. So let's take a look at a deck. So there is uh, one thing I was actually talking That is a wrong deck, by the way. <laughs> you see, I took the wrong deck. There we go. That's the right deck. Uh, so a poison one, right? So first of all, when I said there's one card that you can uh, change, it is actually one Absol, and you can change one Absol into Hoopa if you want to, right? Not necessary, but you can do that. So yeah, so this is a version with Absols, and there's a lot of people that are like, oh, oh Absol, I hate that card, like, oh, Absol, Absol, Absol. Actually, it is helpful when you're playing things like Zashin, right? It's like, oh, but no one hard uh, retreats. Yeah, they do. It's like you don't see it because of cards like Air Balloon, right? They retreat, but they don't have to pay any energy. Because if the retreat cost is 2, you have Air Balloon that decreases that. Well, you get a free retreat cost. Why, you know, you, sh you, sh you should pay. So this actually helps out, right? So if there is a Zashan that has Air Balloon on it, you increase the retreat cost. So they still have to go and discard that energy, which is really helpful in the long run. On top of that, we are going to be playing a lot of Toxic Rogues to put that poison in and, you know, adding every bit of a poison counts, you know, have one Toxic Rogue, have that poison for two turns and your mods, you know, your opponent mods are in a range of uh, 270 damage that our Eternatus VMAX can deal. So let's take a look at the whole deck. Of course, it is in the description, right? And you can subscribe to the channel right now. You can do that. A spec giveaway coming, right? At 2000, but let's take a look. We got 21 Pokemons, 28 trainer cards, and 11 energy. I know, a lot of mods, but we're gonna have a really big band, big bench, and we need that big bench right there. So two Absols from Team Up. We got 4-3 line of uh, Krogenic and Toxic Rogue. You can go for 4-4 uh, four, four, if you have the 4th Toxic Rogue, I just don't, so I went like that. 3 uh, Crowbat Vs, 4-3 Line of Eternatus V and the VMAX with 2 Slowbro Vs. On top of that, we got 3 Great Balls, 1 Pole Pad, 3 Pokemon Communications and 4 Quick Balls with 4 Switches but also 3 Dark Cities. So 3 Retreat Cost on all our basics like Crowbat, Slowbro, Kroganuk, Eternatus V, not a VMAX, and Absol. Then we got three Boss Oldest, three Marnies, four Research, two Capture Energies with two Hiding Energies, and seven Dark Type Energies. That is, as you can see, there's not a lot of retrieval of energy, right? This is straightforward. You want to go hard, you want to hit hard. There's no turning back from playing that. You just go hard, and that is it. And you'll set exactly in the gameplay portion that we're moving right now. So let's go to the gameplay portion of the video. She's like, yeah, because like she's getting lost in the galleries or like, you know, um, in, in the city center in general, even though she works there. Not in the gallery, but like in the city center. So I'm like, all right. <laughs> okay, is it Rema? Tell me. No. On one hand, I'm happy. On one hand, I'm like, uh oh. <laughs> okay, um, good luck, Rema. Good luck. Have fun. Please don't destroy me. Pretty please, um, and for anything that might happen, I I, I apologize. All right, so you're going first. What are you playing? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> good luck, good luck, have fun. I mean, you can keep the stream up. Uh, it's good, keep the stream up. It's, it's gonna be fine. But holy moly, I don't think I like what, what I see. To be honest. I really don't think I like what I see. Like, if I'm not gonna be fast enough, this Waylord is gonna... Yep, 
it's it, it's gonna be bad Research. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I mean, it's a turn two. How you already have Waylord and a Frost Mode. Don't tell me you're gonna be able to knock me out. Okay, no knockout. Great, 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 great. Keep it that way. I think I got a bit lucky here, but those are two prize cards only, so there's still a lot that can happen. Like, you see, when, when I'm facing Rema, I'm like, I'm cheering for him. You see, I want those ammos to hit. Oh, come on, really? That is just bad. I mean, one of the ammos should hit. Honestly, one of those ammos should have hit.
Like, I'm, okay, I must knock out this guy. Thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate that. Like, I must go for those knockouts, because... He can knock me out back. So now, Snom goes front. <coughs> if there's Nessa, we got a problem. I don't have a switch, so I can't really... Alright, Spike Muff. I mean, it works both ways, so... Now I drew a switch. Like with, I was without a switch, so even if I would attack with my whole bench, I would hit 270. I, I, I don't like, you know, the way we've won. I really don't. But thank you for the game, Rema. I, I, but I don't really like the way we've won. I've won. Why well, is it we? I'm not a Venom. But still, like, the setup is quite cool. Like, you can get those pieces really early, which is super surprising. So, you know, that's great, but yeah. And like, on the other hand, like, how is our game the longest, right? I didn't thought about it. I went like, I want to go, you know, how am I focusing like one card in particular and I'm just going for it? That, that was that instant. I was so focused on, you know, knocking out that uh, frost move that I, my brain skipped on everything else you've got. So it was not on purpose by any means. My brain skipped that. It's like, now you're like, oh yeah, there was a dead eh? So by any means, there was nothing uh, done on, on, on purpose. Um, Kovac, yes, that's my fiance. Mm, pass. We're gonna leave one open. So like, yeah, there was there was like nothing on purpose to do this. I was like, yeah, why have I not? Speaking of, Rama, how many packs you've got for trade? And have you uh, have you traded Bolton that you've opened, or was it a locked one? Oh, that's wheezing with okay with alternatives. All right. Uh, 
so getting boss would be nice here right now. Not gonna lie, okay, I'm gonna play you. Um, switch, so I will actually draw a lot. And come on, boss, 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 yes! Absolutely, I can leave one open. That is enough for a dread end to knock him out. Whew. Like, all I knew was I don't want to. 72 Viv. Rebel Clash 1. Wow. <laughs> For DAA, yeah. I mean, you can, you know, that or for Rebel Clash, but, you know, then again, it's like, am I gonna open Boltend, right, or something? So you got 36 on top of the 72. Alright, so the uh, ability is not working. Okay, so I'm gonna go discard you. I'm gonna discard you. That's it. Oh, Bolton was locked. Ah, peanuts. It'll be gone already. <laughs> So we were talking about this wheezing, right? Neutralizing gas. So my problem with this wheezing for Yan Mega, right? Or Yamask, Yan Mega, is that it has three retreat costs, so I would have to I mean I can't even go and play Dark Sea. I would have to go and play special energy on him. But then I'm like, yeah, I can just go and play, you know, other things. Twenty common chests. Okay, I would ask how. But I genuinely think that at this point you're just not spending anything or not opening anything. It's like, that's what I got. That's it. I'm leaving it. Okay, so... First of all, I'm gonna go and play Crowbat. I think they were from the original Players' Cup. Really? Oh yeah, so, oh yeah, because I forgot about, uh, I forgot to ask you about that. Did the current one had any rewards whatsoever? In that regard, because like, you re remember, right? Last time, there were rewards, right? You know, for qualifying you got. Um, then if you qualified for the week two, there were only coins. So after you qualify, there was like nothing. Huh. That's just kind of a shame, you know? Like you would think they would, you know, add something. Or at least give you something, right? Yeah, okay, there was deck box and, 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 and sleeves, okay. Yeah, yeah, because like that, that, that's what I was asking for, uh, or about. But yeah, that's... Hmm. So that's even less, you know... Okay, so that's even really less, less than I thought. Okay, so if he's gonna go, he is going to go and play um, Weezing. And like this one, I'm in it for the bling. <laughs> I feel like at this point, if you're gonna enter, right? If you're gonna get those sleeves, you're just gonna go and trade them for those 60 or 70, you know, battle styles packs. 
Because that's how I feel about it. It's like, at this point... There's nothing else than doing that, right? It's like, all right, I'm going to trade it for those, like, 80 packs or whatever. Uh, the sleeves are going to be in a deck box. And I'm going to have a blast. Okay, so... It gives my ego a boost. <laughs> Aww. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I get that. Um, nope. Crowbats. Um, research. Great ball, come on, please. Yes! Okay, so first of all, Dark City. Retreat. Poison. Great. Switch. Alternatives. Big Bench. One, two, three. Let's go. It's like he must retreat. I uh, still have boss's orders too, right? Okay, yeah, there's like no abilities, but what I can do is I can just discard this fella, this fella, and one, Krogonik. Mm hmm. Okay, so let's think about problems I might have. Right? It's like, love them or hate them, but they are ridiculous. Um, hmm. Like, if I'm gonna keep that, he's knocking me out, then... Like, okay, whatever's gonna happen, like, he he's still knocking me out, so it doesn't matter that much. Like, whenever I'm looking at those online tournaments... In terms of like, you know, when I'm talking to Tom, because like, I know Tom is really into, into, into telling me who, what player, what does what, and everything. What surprised me the most, and either it shows two things, because you don't really see many of the top players taking the top spots. Like, they are always around. Right? But you have a lot of newcomers getting in. Which can mean two things. One, again, the RNG, not a best of three, right? You know, different format, not IRL. Understandable. Um, but also, this also can mean that there's a lot of players that, you know, are not really uh, playing IRL. And there you have it, the Tyrantus deck, right? Another one, the Poison one for Friday for you, so you can actually have a fantastic time during the weekend, maybe you know, during your weekend league, if there is any uh, where you live right now. Of course, don't forget that in the description there's also 5% discount code on any code you purchase on Professor Oak with the TCG player code, and we're almost at 2,000 subscribers. We can do it, guys. We can do it. We can reach that giveaway. That is going to be fantastic. Huge, huge milestone. So for now, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye, good night, have fantastic rest of the day. Take care. Bye.